<laughs> Welcome to Onwards Transmission. <laughs> How did you come to the conclusion of what vehicle classes would be in the game? That was a really tough and kind of iterative process. So we started off with bikes, buggies, cars and trucks. And then from there, it was trying to create a balance of abilities where players of different skill sets and abilities can pick one that favours their strengths, but also trying to create a lineup where they balance each other out. So you could have a team lineup of all the vehicles and yet it still always feels fair. We only started off with a much smaller number that we have in the game right now. And what we found is that for every kind of ability that we added to the game, we needed to add a counter ability, something that would offset it. So if someone has the dynamo, they can play in the outlaw and that can be the offset to that vehicle. So it's a lot of experimentation ultimately, because you've got to remember, you're driving 100 miles an hour and you've got to be very clear about what these vehicles can and yeah. can't do at any one time. How many different vehicle classes are in Onrush? We have eight vehicle classes, all with unique abilities. The primary ability gets used when you rush. So that can be anything as simple as Rampage, which basically turns you into a speeding bullet and gives you more rush every time you take somebody down. To the slightly more esoteric ones where you're draining boost off the opposition as you pass. There's quite a variety. When you mix and match them together, especially in different game modes or even different tracks, you'll come out with a winning combination which you wouldn't have originally thought of. We're still finding new ways to exploit the entire system that we've got and we've been making it for two years. Rush is more than just one thing, isn't it? Because each vehicle class has a special ability, Rush Fuel and a Rush Ultimate. What is a good example of a special ability for one of the vehicle class? The special ability for all of the vehicle classes is active all of the time. Like you don't have to do anything for that to come into play. So the Dynamo, for example, is constantly dropping boost supplies for the rest of your team. The Rush Fuel directly contributes to your rush, so you can earn it more quickly. And each of the vehicles has a different ability that earns that Rush Fuel. So for example, the Vortex, if you take routes that lead to more jumps and you can perform good barrel rolls, land that barrel roll, you'll get Rush straight away. Okay. What about the Rush Ultimate? Can you give me an example of one of those? The Rush Ultimates are a big payoff for you individually and they're a massive factor in the team play aspect of the game as well. I think my favourite example of Rush Ultimate is the Blade bike that lays down a devastating trail of fire behind it and you can yeah. get a lot of takedowns. It's that reward and payoff for being on a nimble, agile bike and being vulnerable for a lot of the time. Yeah. And then swinging that right over and causing devastating damage with the Rush Ultimate. What is your ideal lineup for a game? I think every team kind of needs that balance of you need an attacking vehicle or two. You need a support vehicle or two. And you need people to be able to play the right roles when using those vehicles. You mean to make sure that your dynamo is in the middle of your team at any one time. You want the blade out front so it can lay down that trail and cut people up. You want the titan up front, laying down the blockade, blocking people up ahead. So it's about making sure that people play their roles as well. But ideally, yeah, you want one of the bike classes, one of the buggy classes, one of the car classes, and one of the truck classes. You need all that with their kind of tacking and support roles and people playing to their strengths to really kind of get a good team play going on. I've got to ask, what's your favorite vehicle in the game? It changes regularly based upon yeah. the kind of mood, but at the moment, I'm really loving the Vortex. I love the rush wake ability, where you leave this huge trail behind you, where any of your opponents who enter it essentially get pushed out to the side, which means that if you're driving down a tight bridge, you're slamming your opponents into the wall, or if you're in a particular mode like Countdown, it's making it really hard for them to get through those gates. And I just love the versatility of it. It kind of works across all malls and all tracks really well. 